A Kalasian or Mabomian cyst is a chronic inflammatory lesion caused by blockage of gland orifices and stagnation of sebaceous secretions. They may press on the cornea and cause blurred vision from the induced astigmatism. Kalasian clamps are used for incision and curettage of these lesions. In this video, we will discuss the Kalasian clam and its uses. We will also discuss some of the ways to prevent complications associated with its use. But first we would like you to subscribe to the channel so that you may not miss our new videos. You may also share the video with those who may like this topic. Check the description for similar videos and product links. Up to 50% of Kalasian may be cured or improved with medical treatment within one month. However, the remainder will usually require surgical intervention for further resolution. The use of intralational steroids has been advocated in the treatment of Kalasian. However, this has only been effective in small, multiple, and marginal Kalasian whereas incision and curettage are more effective in larger lesions. A significant proportion of patients with Kalasian will therefore require surgical treatment with incision and curettage for complete resolution. Incision and curettage for Kalasian are conventionally performed with local anesthetic injections such as lignocaine 2%. Complications associated with the injections may include bleeding from the injection site, hematoma formation, and ocular damage if the injection penetrates through the eyeball. The injection of local anesthetic solutions is frequently a painful and unpleasant experience for patients. Infiltration of the skin and subcutaneous tissues with local anesthetic solutions produces pain and burning discomfort, which is often severe enough to be the most unpleasant part of a minor surgical procedure. The Kalasian clam is similar to a pair of forceps. One extension has a flat, solid, oval plate, the other, a ring-like structure that is used to clam and retract soft tissues. Kalasian clam is applied to the averted eyelid. The clam is tightened and used to avert and expose the conjunctival aspect of the eyelid. The clam controls bleeding during the procedure and helps in localization of the lesion. It also prevents hematoma formation and accidental damage to the eyeball. Smooth edges with accurate alignment of its blade prevents damage to the eyelid during the surgery. The clam is usually placed after infiltrating the lid with a local anesthetic. The tendency to force the clam into position is to be avoided. Soft screw mechanism to avoid over tightening of the blades resulting in tissue damage. It also prevents frequent eyelid slipping during the surgery. The Kalasian clam of forceps simplify, homogenize, and ease the biopsy of minor salivary glands as well as other areas of the oral mucosa. The forceps induce a temporary vascular compression, thus permitting work under ischemic conditions and better visibility. Round blade not only allows it for Kalasian incision and curettage but also for biopsy of minor salivary glands in eyelids and oral cavity. This are high-quality stainless steel instruments made from surgical-grade stainless steel and is handcrafted by highly trained instrument makers. Later the instrument is surface treated to give them the matte finish. It comes with an instruction manual which gives for cleaning, care, and storage of the instruments. The instruments are reusable and autoclave safe. These are safe for cleaning by enzymatic cleaners and ultrasound cleaning. I hope you liked the video. Feel free to share your views on this issue in the comment section. Check the description for similar videos and product links.